Hey guys, welcome back. It is Vordy here, and I'm going to be jumping into the Japanese version of Final Fantasy Brave Exvius because we've actually got some some free lapis, and there's a pretty interesting event going on for the two-year anniversary. I figured since I am kind of coming back and redoing the videos and kind of getting back into it, I might as well show you what I've been doing with my J uh, my JP account. And really, to be completely honest, I've mostly been just collecting the free rewards and then pulling. That's kind of the best thing to do in the JP version, unless you want to take it seriously, but I don't think that's the... For myself, who likes to ex experience the story, I don't think that's the best approach for myself. So I just do the rewards and I do the pulls. So I'm going to show you guys where my account sits currently, as well as um, we're going to do some pulls on the new banner. Uh, so the way this banner is being broken apart, unlike the step 3, where you spend 5,000 and you, your chances get increased, here it's pretty much... It's like a five-step system, essentially. Uh, so the first pull costs 500 lapis, then 1,000, 1,500, 3,000, 5,000. Each time you're getting an additional reward, as well as a um, some other things. Like you, there's a on step three there, you get a 30% uh, ticket. So 30% increased chance for pulling a rainbow or EX ticket rainbow unit. You, in the first one there, you, it says you get a 1.5% chance increase, which would bump it at like 4.5%. Um, you get some uh, different kinds of trust moogles and everything. So we're going to actually go through all of these uh, and, and take a look. There's a few different banners that are live right now. There's the CG banner, which is between the CG characters. As well as uh, CG Reagan's banner, which is going on right now. He's pretty badass. Uh, and you get some, uh, some interesting units that come with him as well. Okay, so I'm actually just going to jump in and do this uh, half off first. See what kind of luck we get. It's going to define our adventure today. Probably not, but uh, all right, Medius, really? Really, broski? That's what you're gonna do to me like that? Do they have anything free? Oh, hello, a free pull. Sure, why not? Just gonna speed these up a little bit. Also, for the Japanese version in the meantime, guys, the quality is gonna probably look a little bit blurry because I'm using a completely different platform trying to see if it's gonna work better. So I'm just testing it out. It's smoother, but the quality of projection is a lot worse <laughs> because it is actually projecting it over Wi-Fi. It's just cool. So as we were doing like AirPlay, right? But I'm AirPlaying it into a P uh, PC rather than like a Mac. So it's not as sharp. So I'm working on that. I'm going to clean it up a little bit. So eventually the JP version will also look really nice. All right. Nothing here. So let me show you guys my units and then I'm going to jump right into the polls. So as you can see there right in the top left corner, I did get my hands on CG Nicole. I believe that a lot of people are trying to get their hands on him. So I'm pretty happy about that. So just I'm going to scroll through these and you guys can take your time to look at them later on. But it's just more so like showing you guys what I kind of currently have in my box. Um, I did get uh, Pronto literally like two or three days before I started recording off of a free ticket. So, or a free ticket, like a free poll, I got Pronto, so I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, let's see what's else here. I got uh, Kid uh, Ridia. Yeah, Ri Kid Ridia, yeah, that's what this unit's name is. Um, I also got this guy here. What else did you guys might have missed? Gokens there, got Veritas of Earth. I have two Folins on here. Uh, what else? Any more? Laswells. Uh... I don't think anything else has changed other than Pronto and those guys up there. Huh. Oh yeah, Dark Knight Cecil I got. Who else? Whom else? Whom else? Uh, just kind of... I got the... What's his face? Demon Hunter Rain. But I got this a long time ago. That's nothing uh, new. I think that's it for the five star bases. I'm sure as you guys are looking through this, you can always pause and take a look at the units and just kind of be like, oh, okay, you got that as well. So that is my refresher showing you guys what kind of units I'm holding currently. I have Prish from before too. So yeah. So let's get to it. We're gonna jump in and, and pull on these guys right away. Uh, yeah, I think I kind of covered everyone. Yeah, we're good. We good. So obviously the bonus unit or the unit to go for right now is going to be that uh, CG Reagan. So that's kind of the unit we're going for. 
I, I did use him as a friend earlier. He's pretty badass. So let's see here, 500 Lapis. Let's see what kind of lady luck we got. And I think it's just like a single summon-ish style from my personal translation. I didn't look it up yet to see what, what it really is, but it's like, you, it's not a multi-summon by any means. Mmm, that coffee. All right, so single summon, one of the new units from the Reagan banner. Nothing too snabalicious. So here we go, we're gonna spend a thousand Lapis. See what we're gonna get in this one. I did watch people do some pulls earlier and they were getting like two or three or four rainbows by completing the whole chain. So if, uh, in my luck, we might get one, maybe. Maybe one. We wanna set our bar really low. So there you go. The only way you're gonna get an orange or a gold crystal here with Vordy is if you, uh, you're you given to it for free. So here you go, 1500 Lapis. We get an EX ticket here just for actually getting this far, which everybody should be able to get to, I think. you should. Everybody should be able to do this because they gave us a free 10,000 Lapis uh, for this event for the JP version. So unless you're JP main, you should be pretty good. So four. Wow, I've never gotten her apparently, Marie. So, so far, doing really, really well on the pulls as you can tell. 30% for the five star base. Let's go, 3,000 Lapis. Moving up in the chain. As you can see, my JP luck is just as good as my global luck. If you guys haven't forgotten or if you remember, it's just, it's just not there anymore, man. It's just not there anymore. What do we get? So we only get the one rainbow, which is the five, uh, ten percent trust Moogle. So there we go. Again, none of the, none of, no interesting units yet. And then I guess it's the highest chance of getting a five star. Uh, you get a five star? So I think it's a guaranteed five star. I'm not gonna sit here and try and translate it because I don't have time. All right, breaking right away. What is it gonna be? No, it wasn't a guaranteed 5-star, it just had a high chance of 5-star. So there you go. I did not get anything from this banner that was kind of given to us for free. And just because what we're going to do is, I think I can do it. Is it the EX? Yeah, the EX ticket. Oh, it's in the box. I tinks. Is it in the box? Did they give it to you as a reward? Come on. Oh no, they don't. Where is it? Where's the ticket? Where's the ticket, man? Oh, can I do any more? Where's the ticket? I want to know. Is it in here? Oh, here it is. So there's a 30% chance ticket here. I wonder if it does it work on every banner? If I click on this banner. Ah, so it's a, on any banner, really. You get a 30% chance increase for anything. For the sake of the video, uh, since I'm just here for pulling, uh, we're going to go for, for the banner character here. We'll try the 30% ticket. I mean, like... I've wasted everything, so yeah, it's not. This is probably not gonna do anything. Is that even gonna break? To yellow? No. So there you go, 30% ticket increase. That didn't work either. I have uh, some 4-star tickets here. I'll waste these 3 4-star tickets and we'll kind of end it on that. Because it's such RNG as you guys can tell. It, some people get five or six uh, rainbows throughout the whole banner process and then you'll have other people who will probably get nothing like myself. So let me know in the comment section below if you guys got had any better luck on the JP banner. I know that they have increased rates and I, I personally have experienced the fact that you get more than uh, more than one rainbow every like four or five pulls but then you also get unlucky like now and you just get you get nothing. <laughs> So let me know how you guys have been doing. Veritas of Earth. Let me know if you guys have had any better luck than myself. As far as the CG units, let me know which CG units you guys actually have. I understand that Sakura is pretty good. Um, Nicole is really badass. I mean, I maxed him out and he's, he's really good as a support unit. Uh, I'm pretty sure the CG Reagan is also really, really good. But you guys let me know which CG unit you like the best so far and which ones you have. I'm really interested to see how you guys are doing and what you guys have gathered so far. All right, guys, thank you so much for sticking around. If you are new to the channel, hit that like and subscribe button. Stick around for future content. I don't cover the JP version too much, but every so often, especially if it's a big event, I'll try and jump in and uh, 
do some summons at least and just kind of maybe talk about some enhancements. I do understand actually the enhancements just came for all of uh, the, the like the newer units. Actually no, for Tillith. Tillith and those units they came. Let me see here. It's nine. Uh, I think this is the one that I talk about it. If it loads. Oh no, it's the... That is the PvP. Yeah, here it is. So, Nyx gets his enhancements. And uh, if it'll let me move! Come on, JP version. Get a grip. Uh, Vargas gets it. Um, Maxwell gets it. Tillith gets it. Crow gets it. Uh, Glauk gets it. Uh, Gokin gets it. Sylvia gets it. So all these guys get their enhancements. Actually, they're pretty good. Uh, Nyx becomes a little bit stronger because some of his abilities actually start to hit a lot more. He also recovers more MP from these. His damage and his MP increases over here. Uh, Vargas is interesting because he's supposed to be the best AoE unit, uh, at least on the global. That's how they showed him. But here, his enhancements are pretty similar. The really good one is the first one where he gets an increase in how much damage he does with greatsword and stuff. So it's pretty cool. But yeah, anyways, those enhancements did come. So we know in the global version, we're going to be getting those as well, especially for Tillith and those guys. They're, they're just becoming even better. All right, guys. So anyways, let me know in the comment section below what you guys are doing, how you guys are feeling. If you guys are actually still playing the JP version or are, are you like myself when you log in, do some polls, leave, and that's kind of it. All right, guys. Thank you so much for sticking around. I will see you in the next video. This is Vordy, and I'm out of here. Peace.